acoustic performance of different noise barriers. Noise barriers are very advantageous to the reduction in noise emissions globally. It is referred to as noise walls. There is mechanism of noise barrier performance. Incident sound energy that come from source can be reflected by a barrier wall. Some amount of sound energy bending over an obstacle is known as diffracted sound. Some fractions of sound energy are absorbed by noise barrier and some are transmitted through the barrier and reach to receiver. Ground conditions and atmospheric condition are the factors which affect the barrier performance. Properties of the ground surface, source of sound, and height of receivers are included as ground effects. Wind velocity, turbulence, and temperature gradient are included in atmospheric conditions. Noise barriers are classified based on geometries and materials. There are mainly two types of noise barriers based on geometries, single and multiple edge barrier, and based on materials, reflective and absorptive barriers. For T-shaped barriers, insertion loss is increased with increasing width of cap. For simple reflective barriers, insertion loss is increased with increasing height of barrier. Multiple edge barriers provided insertion loss improvements at normal incident ranging from 2.4 to 2.7 dBA. Due to diffraction phenomena by the upper edge of both panels, the double barriers provided large insertion loss over entire frequency ranges. There are different cross-section of noise barrier with mean insertion loss. T-shaped, rectangular, and cylindrical edged noise barriers with different tops especially rigid, absorbing, and soft surfaces was examined the most effective design was a T-shaped barrier with a soft upper surface. The cap provided at the top of the barrier was made of porous wood cement of 85 meter wide and 25 meter thick which provides 2 to 3 dB a reduction in noise levels. It was found that the soft caped T-shaped barrier provides high noise attenuation and the cylindrical design performs worst with soft surfaces. The acoustic performance of random edge barrier was found to be efficient as compared to other conventional barriers over a broad frequency range. Using quadratic residue diffuser to shield the top surface of the T-shape and Y-shape barrier, creates greater insertion loss than using a fibrous absorbent material on the barrier. It was found that the noise barrier with the utilization of recycled plastic performs better at lower frequencies 100 to 250 Hz. Waste rubber geopolymer concrete shows better performance than conventional concrete as have great sound absorption coefficient. Sound absorption increased by recycled textile material for a high perforation rate. The product made of 80% bottom ash showed similar properties to other conventional materials used in this application. Ceramic can be used being a fireproof and resistant to high temperature material as well as good acoustic material. The lightweight porous concrete has sufficient noise absorption and economical saving too as recyclable product. Recycled materials have better efficiency for noise attenuation and are more economically viable. Noise barriers of waste and recycled products will reduce the carbon footprint of noise barrier. The research paper published in the Journal of Environmental Science and Pollution Research, 